Hello everyone, nice to see you. In this a quick trail. How are you today? I hope you all were happy. And today we learn to continue the unit four work lessons five and six. And now before we start the lesson, let's sing the song together. Search for Ping Fang on YouTube. Ping pong. Okay, and now you open the study book, page 50. Today, we learn to continue the unit 4 work, lesson 5. And now, I want to show you 6 words today. You listen, point, and then you repeat. The first one, difficult, có nghĩa là khó. 2. Easy, dễ dàng. 3. Carry, mang một cái gì đó. 4. Travel, đi du lịch. 5. Bring, có nghĩa là mang. Change, thay đổi. Ok, now you listen and point to the words. One, difficult. Two, easy. Three, carry. Four, travel. Five, bring. Six. Change. Okay, and now you listen one more time. Difficult. Again. Difficult. Now you concentrate the end sound. Difficult. Easy. Easy. Carry. Carry. Travel. Travel. Bring. Bring. Change. Change. Okay, you have just finished the words, and now, next activity for you. Listening. Listen and circle. Now you listen and circle the correct word. Example for you with number one. Now let's listen. One. Good morning, everyone. My name's Lindsay Allison, and I'm a zookeeper. Do you like your job? Yes, I do. 
Is it an easy job? No, it isn't. It's a difficult job. Why? You have to work a lot. You have to carry big boxes of food for the animals. Oh. Can you see the circle? This is an example. Now listen and circle. Two. Hi, everyone. I'm Joe Lopez. I'm a truck driver. Is it an easy job? Well, no, it isn't. You have to travel very far. What do you like about your job? I like traveling to different cities. Three. Hello, my name is Marina Ferguson. I'm a hairdresser. Is it an easy job? Yes, it is. You don't have to carry big boxes or travel far. What do you like about your job? I like coloring people's hair. It's really fun. Four. Hello, everyone. My name is Freddie Ryan. I am a movie star. Wow! Is it a difficult job? Yes, it is. Why? You have to practice a lot. You can't make mistakes. Really? Yes, but it's fun too. Okay, and now I will show you the answer keys. Let's check your answer in the study book. Okay, and now next. Useful language. Listen, then practice. Okay, and now you look at this sentence and let's practice together. What do you do? Bạn làm nghề nghiệp gì? I'm a doctor. Tôi là bác sĩ. Is it an easy job? Nó có phải là một nghề nghiệp dễ dàng hay không? No, it isn't. You have to work a lot. Không đâu, bạn phải làm rất nhiều việc. Now, you listen and then you repeat. What do you do? I'm a doctor. Is it an easy job? No, it isn't. You have to work a lot. Now you listen one more time. What do you do? I'm a doctor. Is it an easy job? No, it isn't. You have to work a lot. Okay, now you have just finished the lesson five. Now, let's play the game together to review some words you have learned in the lesson five. Okay, now you look at the picture and then you complete the sentence. Let's start.
Okay, now let's move to the lesson 6. Now on the view open continue page 52. Let's write this together with listening skill. Listening. Listen and tick the box. Look at the pictures. Listen. There is one example. What does Jim's father do? Did your dad bring you to school? Yes, he did. My mom's sick. What does your dad do? My dad's a doctor. Can you see the tick? This is an example. Now listen and tick the box. One. What does Dan's father do? How about you, Dan? What does your dad do? He's a zookeeper. He works at a zoo. Wow! That sounds cool! Two. What does Jim's mother do? What does your mom do? She's a gardener. My uncle's a gardener, too. Oh, really? Yeah, he loves plants and flowers. Three. What does Jim want to be when he grows up? Do you want to be a doctor, Jim? No, I don't. What do you want to be when you grow up? I love animals. I want to be a vet. Four. What does Dan want to be when he grows up? What about you, Dan? What do you want to be when you grow up? Well, I like cooking and making cakes. So do you want to be a cook or a baker? A baker. I want to be a baker. Okay, and now I will show you the answer key. Let's check your answer. Okay, now let's move to other exercise. Now, you look and read. Choose the correct words and write them on the lines. There is one example for you. This is someone who has doctors at a hospital. Đây là một người mà giúp đỡ bác sĩ ở trong bệnh viện. Okay, and you can guess who's this. That's right, it's a nurse. Now, look at question one. This is someone who works indoors and makes food. Đây là một người làm việc bên trong và người uh, và người đó làm thức ăn cho chúng ta. Như vậy, who's this? That's right, it's a cook. So continue, number two. This is someone who cuts hair. And you can guess who's this? That's right. It's very easy. It's a hair razor. Continue. 3. This is a place where doctors work. Đây là một nơi mà bác sĩ làm việc. That's right. Now, let's check your answer. It's a hospital. And continue. 4. This is someone who works indoors and works with children. So, it's a teacher. Now, let's check the answer in your student book.
Các em hãy cùng cô xem và đọc theo các từ vựng cấu trúc có trong video. Cùng cô giải các bài tập có trong video và trong sách nhé. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye and see you in the next week. Thank you.